want to show y'all something. want to talk about my skates real quick. I love these babies, man. I'm telling y'all. Ooh. Ooh. Stop playing. We going to talk about it. Hold on. Hold on. Ooh. Ooh. We going to talk about it. Hold on. Hold on. Give me a second. Peak game. I just want to talk about this real quick, man. I've been wanting to make a skate video for a minute. Uh, or, you know, talk about my skates for a minute. Y'all can see I threw on, like, the yellow laces. You know what I'm saying? Straight up. Looking real fly. You feel me? Black and yellow on my Wiz Khalifa shit. You dig? Get that whole 360. So, first of all, I want to talk about the actual boot. This boot is called a Stacy Baldwin boot. They're mad soft, super soft, hella comfortable. All right. Stacy Baldwin boot, yellow laces. All right. We got the fiberglass wheels. You know what I'm saying? We gonna get into it though. So I technically wear a size 11. They run I forgot how they run, honestly. I think they run big. Yeah, you can kind of see it there, size 10, right? So they run pretty big because I wear a size 11. So size 10, uh, ball and boot for me. All right, mad comfy, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, the other ones, the Stacy Adams, man, they took me like, want to say like three months to like literally break them in with these you don't got to break them in they already like super soft like and then over time skating over time you'll loosen up the leather even more and then they just gonna feel a little bit more comfortable now we're gonna talk about the actual plate uh we're gonna talk about the plate right here so i'm gonna lay these down like this i was trying to stand it up but it ain't gonna work so i want you guys to check out the plate low right plate by sure grip low right plate all right so low right plates they give you like this really low low you know literally it's in the name low right like literally you feel like you're as low as possible on the floor like y'all can see that right look how low the boot is right say like you you like put a lot of weight on this side right or any of the wheels like literally your wheel would touch the the bottom of the boot and you'll trip over yourself so that's how low they are like literally right so look how low they are L look at the truck look at the truck right look how low that is that's what you call a, a low right plate all right so low right plate this plate is a size eight y'all can see it right there boom size eight it's weird how the low right plates uh, sizes are, right? Because this is a 10, size 10 Stacy boot. Then you got a size eight low right plate, right? But then you can kind of tell like it's pretty short. Most trucks, they go up to like here maybe, right? They kind of like wider or whatever, but these ones, they're really special. And uh, I really like these plates, man. I definitely give them a 10 out of 10. I really like it. Um, plates go about for 250. I didn't even talk about that. So the boot, right? The boot is about 130. All right. So I, I basically bought my boot at the skate shop. You know what I'm saying? I was going to buy it somewhere else and then bring it over there. But they actually had these in stock. So I had to, I, it saved me the trip. You feel me? So boot 130, right? The plate literally is 250. It's $250 per set of these plates, right? So they're pretty on the expensive side, you know what I mean? Wheels, they're about like 130, fiberglass wheels, about 130. I used to ride, uh, I used to ride with loose ball wheels. Um, let me see, I have my loose ball wheels somewhere around here. Now I actually have precision. So you can see like, there's the actual bearing inside the wheel. All right, you can see that, see the bearing, it's a red china, China red bearings right here. You can see that clearly, but I just want to show you guys, right? So these are some of the, the best bearings, you know, that's out right now. Of course, they got different selections and different varieties of bearings that you can put, but I decided to go with these China red bearings, you know, and I broke them in. Um, I went from a Stacy Adam boot with a 45 plate and I had uh, loose ball wheels on them to my Stacy uh, Baldwin boots, low right plates, fiberglass wheels, 
precision though. I love these skates, bro. I dropped about 575, almost $600 on these skates. You know what I'm saying? But honestly, bro, they worth it. Like I be skating all the time. Y'all be seeing the videos, you know, I be out there with the crew and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like we really be like skating, skating for real, for real. So this was like a really good investment for me. And it's a great workout every time I go out to the rink. Like I really enjoy skating, you know, um, this past week, I went skating and uh, yeah, you know, I had to throw on the the yellow laces. I had red laces on them, but I was rocking red laces for a minute. So I'm like, man, let me just switch it up one time. And I ended up just go ahead and putting these yellow laces, you know, on my Wiz Khalifa shit. Plus like it stands out when like I'm skating or whatever, you know what I mean? So it just gives it its own little flavor. But yeah, guys, fiberglass, wheels, low right plate, Stacy. Adam, I'm mean, sorry, Stacy Baldwin boots, you know what I'm saying? If you guys are thinking about getting you some skates, you know what I mean? I think these are some of the best skates you can you can get literally on the market right now. These are the best skates right now, literally. Like you can't go wrong with these skates at all. And if you don't know how to skate on fibers, like man, I just think you should just go for it. You feel me? Either way, I think you should still just get them and then just practice like it's really no point on like starting with uh rubber wheels and then trying to go a little smaller and then trying to do uh wooden wheels and stuff like that and then go clay or whatever you feel me foam max and stuff i just say if you want to be a slider because these that's how you slide you feel me um if you want to be a slider man i would just go ahead and grab these fiberglass wheels i would save you the uh the trip with the uh loose balls you feel me because you got to keep the maintenance up on those. With these, it's like, bro, we're good to go, bro. I don't really have to do anything. With those loose balls, bro, I was getting off the rink every time. I had to fix my truck. I had to add oil for the loose ball so it could spin. Like, bro, I was going through it, man. But I had to learn. And so far, I haven't had problems with these, man, at all. Like, literally, favorite skates right now. Better than my last skates. So, if you guys are thinking about getting any type of skates and you guys want to slide and you guys want to just be doing all types of tricks at the rink, I say go with these right here. These are some of the best skates you can get made. Yes, you will drop a bag on them, but so what? If you if you love skating and you like, you know what I'm saying, going out there and you want to challenge yourself, this is where it's at, man. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to talk about my skates. I wanted, I've been wanting to do a video about my skates, you feel me, for a minute. So finally... I finally, you know, got got it done today. Hope you guys are enjoying the video and did enjoy the video. You know what I'm saying? If you did, make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe right now. And I will catch you guys in the next video. If y'all have any questions about my skates or anything else like that, you feel me? Drop it in the comment section down below. Let me know what's good. And then I will get back to you guys and then I'll answer y'all questions and stuff like that. But don't forget to follow me on Instagram, all the social media, everything will be in the description uh, at the bottom. You feel me? And yeah, man, check me out, man. Thank you guys for watching the video. I'm going to holler at y'all. One.